Hello, this is Khaled again with the uh, OnStep and in this video I'm going to show you uh, a minimal setup with the uh, uh, Fset C S6 3D printing board. Um, so the, the printing board is already already comes in soldered with all the connectors. Uh, you just need two drivers, okay? Uh, and the best drivers that work with this board are the TMC SPI ones, which include two models, uh, 2130 and 5160. The board is already uh, jumpered for the SPI uh, driver, so you don't need to uh, uh, get uh, uh, change the jumpers in uh, from what what they are. Uh, and uh, you also need uh, 3D printer uh, motor connectors. So these are the, the connectors. You need three of them. One for Access one, one for one for access one, one for access one, one for access two, and on the other side here I have it wired to uh, uh, small motors. Th these are test motors; are not uh, motors that uh, are suitable for any mount. They are very low uh, current. And in this case, I'm I'm using the uh, Lolin ESP eight two uh, eight two six six. Uh, you can use the Wemos. Uh, so this is what what happened, uh, what I happen to have around. So let us uh, power up and see what what happens. So if I power up, then the the button uh, would go uh, and flash on the Wemos on the uh, uh, Lorin, and what it will do, it will uh, try to connect to on step, and it will keep trying until about you know seven seconds, and then it goes solid like this. So when it goes solid like this. Uh, Wi-Fi is uh, is ready. Let us go to uh, let me let me go to my tablet and uh, connect to one step. Okay, and then fire up the Android Android app. Okay, if we wait a bit, then it will it should connect with Wi-Fi saying here check, check okay that, that's it it's connected but then it's saying time or location not updated so uh, we just press initialize and then set date time you will see that the time is here time gets set here and that's it when you go when you go back okay that error should clear itself immediately that's it uh, now uh, let us see the what the what the go to speed is and I have set it to let us see I put it to default actually default and it will go about 2.3 degrees per second uh, I could make it uh, more if I want to uh, but you have to test it and see if that the motors do not stall and then I will say uh, let's go to uh, no let's let's go to uh, let's say Jupiter so I just select Jupiter here and you see that the motors are are spinning that means that the uh, connections are good that means that the TMCs are, uh, are plugged in uh, you just have to set up the VREF uh, if you're using the TMC uh, 2130. If you're using the 5160, you have to set them in the config.h. Okay, so it's still saying when, when the abort button is highlighted, this means that uh, the uh, it has not reached the uh, destination yet. So in this case, this is the declination motor still spinning, and you see that it's changing the speed and once it reaches there then you see the tracking goes on you see the tracking is on and the other one is not moving and here it says that uh, it's done okay so that's all I wanted to to, to show you that you can have uh, the electronics part of a uh, for an on-step controller is an easy problem to solve if you get something like the s6 uh, uh, the MKS Gen L is also uh, a good solution where, where it doesn't require uh, things for uh, minimal minimal uh, uh, solution, but it's it's much slower than the 
than the S6. So if you can uh, pay the, you know, the I don't know, twenty dollars more or something, then get the S6. Okay, that's all.